Could Lady Louise potentially change her title to become a princess? Before we delve into this topic, please consider subscribing to the channel for more updates on the British royal family. Might Lady Louise contemplate altering her prestigious designation and ascending to the rank of princess? In recent times, numerous individuals from the royal lineage of King Charles III have been bestowed with new titles, yet one has notably remained unchanged. Could Lady Louise, with her own boldness, elevate her current status? On March 10, 2023, Lady Louise's parents were officially recognized as the Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh. Prince Edward, on his 59th birthday, was granted this title by King Charles, fulfilling the long-standing desire of Queen Elizabeth II and Prince Philip. This change also affected Edward and Sophie's son, who now carries his father's secondary title as a gesture of respect. Henceforth, he shall be known as James, Earl of Wessex. However, despite being older than her brother James, Lady Louise remains only a lady. Since her birth in 2003, she has been styled as the daughter of an earl and currently holds the title appropriate for the daughter of a duke, which is also lady. This has sparked discussions about inequality as despite amendments to the laws of succession a decade ago to prioritize birth order and prevent men from superseding women, regulations regarding noble titles have remained unchanged for centuries. Although Louise may be the elder child of the newly appointed Duke of Edinburgh, her brother takes precedence in terms of titles. Nevertheless, there is another title that Lady Louise has yet to embrace. According to the renowned letters patent of 1917 issued by King George V, she has the potential to be recognized as HRH Princess Louise. These letters patent, signed by a king who aimed to reduce the number of individuals within his family holding royal titles, restricted the use of HRH and prince or princess solely to children and grandchildren in the male line. Once again, this tradition hardly corresponds with the principles of equality in the 21st century as only the children of male line descendants are included. However, it does offer the opportunity for a princess to potentially emerge as the 15th in line to the throne. Nonetheless, her own family members have expressed skepticism that this will ever come to fruition. Back in 1999, when the current Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh got married, they made it clear that their children would not be burdened with royal titles. Sophie raised this issue in a 2021 interview just before her daughter turned 18, stating, We strive to instill in them the understanding that they will most likely have to work for a living. Hence, we made the decision to forego the use of HRH titles. They possess them and can choose to employ them once they turn 18, but I believe the chances are slim. When Louise reached 18 in December 2021, she made no changes to her title and has shown no inclination to do so in the foreseeable future. Moreover, she has already entered the workforce, taking up a temporary job at a garden center before starting her university studies in Scotland. But could she truly become a princess if she were to decide on it in the future? It seems unlikely as King Charles has long desired a streamlined monarchy. Additionally, the dukedom of Edinburgh bestowed upon Prince Edward is solely for his lifetime and will not be passed down. Lady Louise, who has gained widespread acclaim for her composed confidence in public engagements she has undertaken, already seems self-assured enough to chart her own course in life. This past year has been filled with discussions about titles and naturally it remains a fascinating aspect of royal existence. However, ultimately, it's always the individual's mindset that holds as much importance as the purported historical attributes that accompany it. In the 21st century, the princess who could have been but chose not to be serves as a strong indication of how the monarchy will evolve. Thank you for watching until the end. Please share your thoughts in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more updates.